And guess what? I'm qualified to buy a home for $1.5 million. But is it really going to work out for you? Affordability versus what you actually qualify for are two different things. Take it from a lender. So when we complete your pre-qualification or pre-approval, we are looking at your gross income. Your gross income. I don't know about you, but half of my gross income, psh, gone. Taxes. Then I also have insurance and all this other stuff that comes out of my paycheck, right? So when you're planning to buy a home, plan it out in such a way. And if you're dealing with me, we've already done this, but you're going to talk to your lender and they're going to talk about what your affordability range is. It may be different from the range that you qualify for. Okay. Uh, you may qualify for something much higher than what you actually feel comfortable with paying. It's important to have this discussion early because if you need to make some changes to your budget, then you need to know that before you get into contract on the purchase of your home. Okay. So do this planning up front. Your lender should help you with that and you'll be in the perfect position to buy a home and comfortably make your payment on your new home. We'll see you on the next one.